Welcome to Airmeans, your Etsy fashion store. Shop with the confidence. Hurry up now 30% off. Find the link in the description. A recent documentary chronicling longtime feud between Taylor Swift and Scooter Braun sparked a slew of mixed reactions from social media users, the two-part docuseries titled, Taylor Swift vs. Scooter Braun, Bad Blood was released on Max on June 21, featuring interviews from industry experts and producers, weighing on bitter row between the duo, however. Viewers were left unsatisfied with the portrayal of Taylor Swift in the series, noting she was cast as a villain despite her fair fight for her. Writes, this documentary is very biased and favoring towards, expletive, Scooter Braun painting him as a good guy who's just doing business thing and painting Taylor Swift as a villain and greedy once again, seated one. This documentary is biased, nonsense, and a trash. The current Taylor Swift discourse shows me we are deaf back in 2016 because why are there thousands of people on Reddit talking about how Scooter Braun is actually such an innocent victim of Taylor Swift and she destroyed his life? Like, how delusional are these PPL, another lamented, for the unversed, the Midnight's artists publicly accused the former music manager of, incessant, manipulative bullying, after he acquired Scott Borchetta's Big Machine label group which owned the rights to the singer's first six albums, Braun went on to bar Swift from purchasing the masters, leading to her re-recording the albums in an attempt to maintain the ownership. 